Marriage is a commitment to life, the best that two people can find and bring out in each other. It offers opportunities for sharing and growth that no other relationship can equal. Chris, I can't believe that today I get to become your wife. I waited my whole life for you. I never thought I would find someone who loved me the way you do. Thank you for being so loving and always trying to protect me. I love watching you with the kids and I love that no matter what, our family is the most important thing to you. I am so extremely proud of the man you are. I'm so excited to spend my forever with you. You are my love, my heart, and my reason to constantly better myself. I hope that you are half as proud to call me your wife as I am to call you my husband. Having you by my side makes the bad days better, and the good days, well, those are out of this world. Today, you become my person, my husband forever. I look forward to growing old with you and feel so fortunate that you chose me to be your wife. I love you. Let's have the best day celebrating our love and try to gross the kids out with some awkward kisses. With all my heart, Jenny. P.S. Happy anniversary. To the love of my life, today's the day we made it. I could not be happier and I know you are going to look so beautiful. Our story isn't really a from the moment I met you kind of love. We have grown into a love that is solid, pure, and exactly what I am wanting in a partner for life. You have become my everything and have made me the happiest man alive. Without missing a beat, you hopped into some mom's shoes and never looked back. Stepmom, mom, mother, Jenny, Jim, Jim, take your pick. Our kids adore you, and that is just perfect. Our family is complete with you in it. I know this hasn't always been the easiest journey, but you and I have shown we can weather any storm and adversity. The road ahead of us may get a little bumpy at times, but just know I will give my all, give my best, and fight for what we have built. Thank you for always standing by my side and supporting me, encouraging me, and loving me. We both know that tomorrow is never promised, so my promise to you is to live each day, treat this marriage and family, and love you like it's our last, every day for as long as we've got. I love you and cannot wait to see you and call you my wife, Chris. Um, I am so excited for Jenny and Chris um, to start their life as a finally married couple. Happy anniversary! I am Stevie Chateau. I am the wedding planning extraordinaire major of honor. We have a lot of years worth of friendship and we've spent a lot of time together in our 20s and made some of the best memories like celebrating many holidays that require dressing up, concerts, fist pumping, making sure my feet always stay planted. Uh, we lived together for a short amount of time. You also stood by my side on my day and I'm so honored that I get to see it by you and now that you found your lobster. Now onto your lobster. I think in life we need people who teach us and are able to open us up to new experiences without hesitation <clears throat> and judgment and Chris has done that. You not only love him for everything that he is, but you love him and his children as your own. Okay. Jenny and Chris are a complete balance to each other. I have some advice. Choose each other over and over and over without pause without a doubt, and a heartbeat, just keep choosing each other. The best love is the kind that awakens the soul, that makes you reach for more, that plants fire in the hearts, and brings peace to our minds. You two are truly meant for each other, and I love you both. So, I'm uh, Brandon Wilson with The Best Man. I don't have a lot prepared here, other than uh, to say I love you both. Um, I've known Chris for 10 years, met him at an event similar to this. A couple years later, he's rooming with me in my house. We uh, spent a lot of crazy nights drinking and watching football, bobbing over that. 
Jenny was a gal that grew up next to uh, a good fam uh, family friends of ours. You know, I just kind of seen her around the way, and then all of a sudden, you know, serendipity brought them together. You know, I've known her for five years now, and you know, the love they have for each other is truly a testimony to uh, to this event. And I uh, just wish you both the best. You know, and I love the kids and. Anything you guys ever need, you know I'm there for you. Dear Jenny, today is the day that you married the love of your life. And today you become my mom. <laughs> From the moment I met you when I was ten and a half years old, I knew that you were going to marry my father. There was this happiness in his eyes when he was with you, and I knew that you were meant for him. I love you, and I love the family that you come with. I love our dance parties and our love. <laughs> I love our binge TV show parties. Being a stepmom is hard, but treating kids that aren't your own can also sometimes be harder. But you've never failed to do so. You've always treated me and loved me as your own. Blood doesn't decide a family; love does. And I'm so glad that I was blessed with the most amazing mom ever. I love you. my dad, I think of someone who loves adventure, who is driven, is the world's greatest fisher. Um, you are my first hero <laughs> and my first best friend. I am unbelievably proud of you and I'm so happy you have found someone to share the rest of your life with. I wanted to thank you for everything you have done for me. I'm truly and incredibly blessed to have you as my dad. You are my biggest supporter, my best bud, my rock and my inspiration. I know I can always count on you in every ugly situation, especially when you sit in the passenger seat and me learning to drive. <laughs> I'm so grateful that you met your person, and I'm so grateful that person is Jenny. She's the most amazing woman ever. I love you both. Congratulations. I'm Jenny's little brother, Tice. Uh, I am the only son and youngest of four children. Uh, Jenny and I were incredibly close growing up. Uh, we're always there through our highs and helped each other through our lows. And I've never seen Jenny happier than she has been since she met Chris. I always wanted one, but I never had a brother. And over the years, you've gone from this great guy that my sister would be to someone I would consider a close friend. And I couldn't be more to work. The day you came up. I love you. Chris, do you here in the presence of family and friends declare your love for and commitment to Jenny, choosing her as your life partner, soulmate, freely offering yourself to her and willingly accept the gift of self she offers to you? I do. Jenny, do you here in the presence of friends and family Declare your love for and commitment to Chris, choosing him as your life partner and soulmate, freely offering yourself to him and willingly accept the gift that he offers to you. I do. Chris, please place the ring on Jenny's finger and repeat after me. Jenny, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love. Jenny, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love. And with all that I am, and all that I have. And with all that I am, and all that I have. And all that I shall be, in honor of our love. And all that I shall be, in honor of our love. Jenny, please place the ring on Chris's finger and repeat after me. Chris, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love and commitment. Chris, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love and commitment. And with all that I am, and all that I have. And with all that I am, and all that I have and all that I shall be in honor, in honor of our love. And all that I shall be in honor of our love. Through this ceremony, Jenny and Chris have vowed to be loyal and loving to each other and have formalized the existence of the bond between them through words spoken and rings received. By the, by the power invested in me by the state of Missouri, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You make this proud.
Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Falcon. Jenny and I talked about something that we wanted to do tonight that wasn't able to be done the first time. Um, there are two people here that, you know, through the circumstances of them getting married and where they were, they never had an opportunity for a first dance. So, Tice, grab your bride.
Hello, Jenny. It's Brian Baumgartner here, and I just want to wish you a big and hearty congratulations for marrying that sly dog, Chris. He finally got you to say yes, huh? Well, that is huge. That's what she said. Um, I understand you guys are big fans of The Office. Thank you so much for that. And, you know, I had a, a long message written out, but I, I just thought, why say a lot words when a few words do trick? You know what I'm saying there, Jenny? And here's the important thing. Chris really hopes that you like less instead of more. Just think about that later on when you're alone. Less can be more. Congratulations on this amazing day. I hope it was fantastic for you both. And uh, here's my cheers to you for many, many happy years in the future. Nice. Ha, 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 ha.